Three minutes about electromagnetic pollution. When we speak about electromagnetic pollution, we speak about radiation and about magnetic field exposure. There are two different things, and even within those there are subcategories. In fact, there are between seven and nine subcategories of electromagnetic pollution. And most people are fixated on just one or two. They know about cell phone and they worry just about cell phones. They know about uh, magnetic fields and they only worry about magnetic fields. But if you understand that there are seven, eight or even nine types of exposures, you understand that there is no simple solution. And don't, please, don't believe when somebody tries to sell you one little pendant, one little uh, um, gadget that they say will protect you from all types of electromagnetic pollution, those gadgets are usually not scientifically produced, there are no engineering principles to them, and if anybody who is an electrical engineering scientist breaks them down, there will be nothing in them to justify the claims that the salespeople are making about them. There are a lot of other gadgets that people say will help you, ground you, eliminate the charge within your body, and many, many of those are not founded in scientific principles. Electromagnetic field and radiation are based in the physical world of science, and therefore they should be addressed therapeutically and preemptively with the same approach. If you are making a claim, you have to prove it scientifically, and the gadget that you're selling has to be promoted by scientists who have studied the real effect of this um, gadget on the human physiology in a reproducible manner. Some things might give you a benefit temporarily, but they will cause problem in the long run. Or they might give you a benefit in your home, but they will cause a problem in another home. Or a benefit in one room, but cause you more damage in another room. You cannot rely on those things. There are products, however, and there are simple remedies that you can engage in that have been proven scientific and are produced by electrical engineers or by professors of electrical engineering who created specific instruments that can neutralize some of those factors that are detrimental to our health, that are electromagnetic radiation and fields. And we speak more about those in our teleseminar about electromagnetic pollution and at the ecopolitan.com eco shop.